welcome back to another video. Today is going to be a quick video where I'm going to be sharing with you my first experience of shopping at Timu. Um, I've seen a lot of um, videos online of people shopping on Timu and buying some other things so I thought I'd download the app and have a scroll through and I must say it's quite addictive and there's a lot being added to my basket but I've only, I only thought I'd just give it a little go on one small item first. It's for the workshop uh, hopefully it'll make it look a little bit nicer and a bit warmer in here. It's very well packed because it is actually a metre across. It's actually a carpet or a rug for the workshop. So let's give it a quick open and I'll know what we got. It only took, surprisingly enough, seven days to get here. Which, um, that's surprising. And the actual tracking on the actual app is amazing, it even shows you when the flight's left, when the flight lands, etc. Um, so I was quite impressed with that, and it was only 10 quid. So, it doesn't feel much like a carpet, it feels more like a plush toy, like a teddy bear toy. So I think that might be in keeping with the general feel of the workshop at the moment. The old fender. It's a little bit creased, but I think oh, actually that's brushing out quite nicely. But if you can see that on camera, it's just it feels like it looks like a plush toy teddy bear skin. So I don't know how many teddy bears died in the making of this actual rug. But we put it down and we'll have a look. I'm impressed with the actual general look of it. How long it lasts in here is another matter. It's got the non slip back in as well, which is pretty good. Let's whack it down and we'll have a look. So we are laying down on the floor. Um, it's still got some creases in it. I'm hoping they're going to come out, but I might just bring the vacuum cleaner down and just give it a, a light going over. So I don't know if you can actually see. You know, especially on the black, if you brush it the wrong, the nap the wrong way, you can see like the white through it from the back in. But it's almost like a velour sort of rug. So it's um, a musical carpet fashion. <laughs> Whether that means a musical carpet, it's like a magic carpet. But I don't know. I'm quite impressed with it. I quite like it. Looks nice in here. It's probably going to get beaten to death with my muddy feet and car oil, engine oil and polish, all sorts of things on the air, but for 10 quid you can't really complain really. Yeah, the floor's not completely level. You may have seen in a previous video where I tried to level this floor because we had subsidence in this corner here. So I cemented all this floor here and uh, tried to get as level as possible. So it used to be actually two different rooms. This used to be a wall across here. So um, that side of the wall was lower than this side of the wall. So I tried to level it as much as possible. but. I think, I think you'll agree, it looks quite nice, quite fitting, quite in keeping. I'm quite impressed with it for a tenner. Yeah, I like it. Tell me what you think in the comments below, whether you've used Timu or Temu or whatever you want to call it, or how you pronounce it. Uh, if you've used it before and what are your experiences. But I've, I, for the first experience with the actual um, app and the website and shipping etc it's been perfect coming all the way from china as well i don't think you can really moan at that sort of service um and the prices are dirt cheap yeah the quality is not excellent but it's 10 quid isn't it it's nothing yeah so what does that say musicians 1946 musical carpet fashion electric guitars and amplifiers i just think it's great Sort of warms the room up a little bit, gives you that sort of higher end look rather than just an old shed. So I've got a lot more changes and bits and pieces due to the workshop that will come up in future videos. Um, I'm going to be panelling the walls out, making it a little bit warmer. Similar to what I did there, but with OSB board. And then uh, Stan is going to be coming over and he's going to help me do all the rewiring. I'm going to put some more sockets in and do it into a, turn it into a ring main, not just a... Um, linear wherever it is i can't remember i'm not really up on electrics but anyway i digress so uh, 
yeah from my first experience with Timu perfect so if you've liked this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe stay tuned for more content and I'll see you in the next video